Dozens of local pilots are preparing to fly essential supplies to Western North Carolina this morning. Yeah, they'll leave from Lincoln County in just a few hours. Queen City News reporter Savannah Rudisell is live there at the airport in Iron Station. And Savannah, what is going on? It sounds like a lot of uh, helpful volunteers. Yeah, Jason and Julian, as of right now, this event is starting at 8 o'clock is when we're going to see more of these pilots, more of the volunteers start showing up. But here in the early morning hours, we're starting to see them refuel some of the planes that just made it in last night, as well as trying to prepare some of these uh, uh, machines for a longer flight. I want to give you a look at what is lined up here at the Lincolnton, Lincoln County Airport. And right here along the airfield, we've got a lot of different types of planes. These are all privately owned and uh, uh, some of we got some helicopters as well as some more uh, more streamlined planes as well. They were able to get out yesterday. They said at least 60 trips with all of these planes. They are loaded up with supplies, things that are trying to reach the people in some of the hardest hit areas in Western North Carolina. And these uh, planes are all each individually going out there and dropping off supplies. And we were talking with some of the managers of the airfield here this morning. One thing that's keeping them very busy is President Biden's trip. And he's taking an aerial tour over some of those impacted areas as well, which really impacts how these pilots go because there is a temporary stoppage. It and you can't quite share that airspace when you have the sitting president in it as well. So that's something that they are working out right now as they're starting to refuel some of these planes. And then coming up here in just our next half hour, we're going to be live with all of these volunteers as they tell us a little bit more about why this community-led effort is going so strong and what they hope to accomplish a little bit later today and through the rest of the week. We're going to bring that to you coming up just about every half hour here for the rest of the morning. Reporting live in Iron Station, Savannah Rudisell, Queen City News.